guys, John from Magic Tech Review. How are you guys doing today? And in today's video, we're going to take a look at the differences, the real difference between 5G and 4G, as you guys can see in the screenshot right here, provided by Android Authority. So if you haven't checked them out, go ahead and do so. Go ahead and leave a like on the video if you enjoy the content. Go ahead and subscribe to become part of the Magic Tech Review family and comment down below. Are you excited about 5G? Do you want 5G right now? Or do you not really give a beep? Anyways, so as you guys can see the screenshot here, uh, ping is the same. Now, this was taken in the same exact location, same exact conditions. Uh, literally, it was just one was the 5G Nighthawk thing and the other one was a 4G LTE device. Uh, both things were both things were run approximately at the same time, same area, like I said. And this is what we actually got, or this is what the testers got. And it, this is a consumer grade product. This is not actually like a, uh, a product that is given to testers or to given to the media. It's literally, you have to buy this thing. You have to, and I mean, look at what you're getting. You're getting a few more megabits per second download and a few more megabits per second upload like I mean okay maybe it's double it's double the upload speed but the download speed is pretty much the same 5G I thought was supposed to be this revolutionary thing where it's gonna be like gigabit speeds and all this other craziness and you know they're talking about 5G like it's the next best next biggest thing since uh, sliced bread or since the phone so I think they're just trying to hype it up and I'm certainly not willing to pay 20 30 40 50 or 60 or 100 more dollars just for this little bit of speed here that we got i mean i don't see anything wrong with 4g lte to be perfectly honest with you and if they were to just make their 4g lte stronger it'd be fine i just think that this country or this these people are just trying to really just trying to market something new and come out with something new to charge us more and more and more just like the planned obsolescence of their phones, they're doing the same planned obsolescence with their signals. But that's just my opinion. That's one man's opinion on the internet. I want your guys' opinion, women and men, uh, on this topic. So thank you guys for watching. This is John from Magic Tech Review, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to leave a like. Bye-bye <laughs> now.